Hey guys, so this week's video is about painting the Assault Intercessor Space Marines. In this particular video, I will be showing you how to paint the Sergeant, but all the same techniques will apply for the regular blue-headed Assault Intercessor. Just instead of doing the green eyes that you would do for your Sergeant, you would do the red eyes for the regular blue-headed Assault Intercessor. I'll also show you how I did this very simple kind of Martian green terrain land. I'm going to put a tough on it as well. I haven't painted the base black yet. I will be painting the base black just to finish it off. I do think you should paint your bases, um, but I'm really pleased with how this has turned out and I'll show you everything in this video. So to begin with, I based the miniature in McCrag Blue. This is a two to one paint to water ratio. Normally I would prime and then I would spray it with a can of McCrag Blue, but I didn't have any to hand, so I used the blue straight from the pot. I wouldn't recommend this, it was a lot more time consuming, but it still does the job. So painting, just working up and down all across the body, ensuring there's no clumps. Once it's fully dry, I gave it another coat of McCrag Blue, but this time it was just a dry brush to get that real smooth finish. So next I painted the gun, sword, pouch and the joints on the Space Marine all in Abaddon Black. Again as it's a base coat, I thinned it down with a 2 to 1 paint to water ratio. This just helps it go on that a little bit easier. Don't panic too much if you go over the McCrag Blue a little bit, try not to. But if you do, just wait for it all to dry and then go back over with the McCrag Blue just to get that clean finish. Next up is to apply the lead belcher to the exhaust pipes and the vents on the backpack, the metal parts on the gun and the blade. This paint is a lot thinner so I just did a 1 to 1 ratio. Next I applied two coats of the Corex White to the Sergeant's badge, just a drop of paint and a drop of water. So as this is the Sergeant, the right side of his badge and the head is going to be red. Next is to apply some gold to the sergeant. Using Retributor Armour, I applied it to the shoulder pads, the skull on the arm, the chest plate, and also just on the back of the backpack, there's a little brown plate. I gave that a coat of Retributor Armour as well. Next up is to paint the gun holster on the sergeant's back. I gave it a coat of Bugman's Glow and then I gave it a wash of Agrax Earth Shade just to darken the leather and create some shadows. When you put the Bugman's Glow on, it will look quite bright initially. Once it's dried and then you've applied the Agrax Earth Shade, it will be a lot more darker and the leather will look fantastic. Next, using a small brush, apply Wild Flesh to the Sergeant's control panel on his arm and also to his eyes. To finish, I gave it an all over shade with non-oil. Moving on, I based the unit with Astra Granite. Just using a stirring stick, I just moved it slowly around the base. Once it's all dry and set, I gave it a wash with Bill Tan Green. As I wanted to keep my Martian terrain fairly simple, I just glued on some tufts to the base and then cleaned the rim of the base with Abaddon Black. Thank you. 
I'm so satisfied with how these have turned out. I, I really enjoyed painting these. I'm kind of gutted the whole set's complete now. Um, let me know in the comments below what you think. Let me know what kind of schemes you're going for for your Space Marines. Um, if you like the video, hit the like and subscribe button and I'll see you next time.